Hey, one and only Xalophony here, wielding the might of Ravioli to face Obelisk the Tormentor, wielded by Mario. And my phone goes buzz buzz. Fun stuff. <laughs> so, we have two giant blue god cards here. We chose them because they're blue. How do you think this is going to go, Mario? Because we both made these decks in like, what was it, 10 minutes or less? Yeah, yeah. just throwing together what we thought was good. <laughs> So what I did is I essentially squished um, a Sacred Beast deck and a Dark World deck together, even though I have very little experience with Dark World. Uh, but I guess this doesn't I mean, hurt. You did face with you did face it in the first season of Fight Club. Yeah, I think the reason I have it is I might have done a deck learning video of it, but then just never touched it since then. So, all right, so I have a uh, Gates of the Dark World there, and I can banish a Fiend Monster from my graveyard, so it's not going to do much just yet. But there's probably some really good plays I could do right here because I'm going to drop a Dark World Dealings and discard that. And when I discard that, I think I get a special effect. Um, What do I get rid of? Because yeah, I'm I all guess... about discarding my own cards to do card effects. Because then I can bring something to my hand. And it's all just more stuff to be discarded by card effect. Um, So let's see. Anything I just want to summon in this deck? I mean... I think the big card, I think it was like Greffer. Yeah, I guess I want to get him into my hand eventually. I don't know. But I don't have any other Dark World cards right now, so let's just grab... I have no idea. Uh, da -da. Yeah, let's just grab the uh, Graffa. That's fine. Um, because my summon is going to be... The great and powerful Curry Bandit, which, you know, is a unique thing. It wasn't in the deck before, but we had just gotten done using Exodia, and this is a Fiend card. So it sounded fun to discard lots of cards in a card in a deck that's built around discarding. Ooh, add a trap card to my hand. Ooh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to play a little risky here. I'm going to grab the Terraforming, actually. And I'll just grab the other Fallen Paradise. We'll thin out the deck a little. I don't know if I need to thin out the deck with this, but there we go. Oh, they don't get their effects like that. Darn it. It was an experiment. Oh, wait. No, I just didn't get anyone that would get their effects. Oh, no, he would. Discarded to the graveyard by card effect. It was, but why did it not work? Let's see. I guess excavate doesn't count as discard. Fair enough. Learned. Probably not worth having that card in the deck, but it was an experiment. As you guys can probably see, we're not running like 40 card decks right now because we just made them and we kind of want to make them better someday. So. Yeah. We maybe do a rematch or maybe red versus blue. Maybe yeah, definitely try the decks yeah. out. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. We're going to set this. And honestly, huh. I th let's just, hmm. I don't know how to use this deck. But we'll activate Terraforming to do what we were going to do a second ago. And there we go. So we got that when we need it. Let's see. So Graffa, I can special summon it by returning one Dark World monster I control. So I need a Dark World monster on the field, which I cannot do right now. I'll end my turn. Yeah, I probably should have just brought some fodder out, but it's all good. So it's you're drawing an obelisk, so you just want to get those three tributes. Yeah. Well, you need three fiends in total. Total though. Yeah, but I also got Dark Summoning Beast support, so that's an edge that I might have. I'm gonna trade in my Graffa because that's what trade ins for. And, okay, let's see. I got this now. I can't really trade in anything. And I think now that Graf is in my graveyard, that's probably special. Um, let's go ahead and normal summon something. So then I think I can get Graf out like that. Yeah, that's how you do it. So weird. Oh, nice. All right, I did something right. Okay, and now I guess I'll start trying to attack, even though it's looking a little risky out there. Graf is essentially invincible because he just comes back. So... Oh, here it goes. Oh, boy. Ooh. Ooh. So good. You know what? Um, we've seen in my duels before that Marsh Macarons can be a plague, but he just used the effect of a Marsh Macaron, so I'm going to end it once and for all. Ray Geki. I knew me? you would try something. Like yes! That. So good, Mario. Oh, that's so good for you. Um, ooh. I did just draw another graph of those, so I'll trade in. And, ooh, Allure of Darkness. Yeah, I think I'm gonna Allure of Darkness, and I will 
get rid of, let's say, Battle Fader. Because, uh, actually, no, I'm about to need Battle Fader, let's be honest. Because I know what you're about to do. Um, but let's see, I just discard with this. Yeah, I banish. So, let's use, yeah, let's just get rid of Battle Fader, I don't care. And, doo -doo 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 -doo. and I think I want to use this card later. Oh, that could be so fun, though. Yeah, you might not even have Obelisk, for all I know. Uh, I guess I'm just going to end my turn there. Because you stopped my Regeki play. Which was a great use of Dark Bribe. I would have stopped both your mash March Macarons from ever doing anything again. And, so. Perfect yeah. use of Dark Bribe. By the way, can I borrow your Griffer? Hey, go for it, man. Soul Exchange. <laughs> Do you have Obelisk? I may. Awesome. I mean, you sent me back to my graveyard, so it's not the worst thing in the world for me, but that's pretty cool. There we go, baby. Obelisk, the Tormentor. Unfortunately, there is one drawback to that. Oh, you I don't can't get it. Yeah. That's a shame. I mean, uh, that's 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 my version of a Dark Summoning Beast, I guess. Yeah, fair enough. It's, it's, it's close. Um, so, I got another Allure of Darkness that I can use. Um, who do I really want to banish? <coughs> well, I suppose what I'm going to do is... This looks too much fun to pass up. Uh, honestly, I don't think I need multiple Graphas, so I'm going to just get rid of one. Yeah. And... Don't really want you to do that right now, so... Let's go ahead... Huh, can I activate this? What can I do with it? I can banish a card from my graveyard. Let's banish this guy and see what happens. Ooh, and then I can just do stuff? That's cool. Well, since I can just do stuff, let's... <laughs> I guess let's do this? Man, I didn't want to do it just yet. Oh, well. Oh, wait. No, that was right. I did the right play. I did something good, Mario. <laughs> then I can add a card from my deck to my hand. I'm going to grab another Dark World Dealings because that's always fun with this deck. Yep. And so, since I have seven cards, let's go ahead and set one down on the field. And end my turn. Because that's all we got right now. <laughs> it's alright, we're going to be fine. We're going to be just fine. Hmm. Hmm. You know, funny enough, I didn't even put this card artwork of Obelisk. It just switched to it for some reason. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't like this one too much, but it is what it is. I, I, I put in the original artwork. <laughs> okay. I love how I've, like, cut my deck in half already at turn 8. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Obelisk attack. Oh! Darn it, that hurt. Oh, yeah. So I activate this now. This'll be fun. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for laughing like a hyena, but that is amazing. <laughs> Thank you for whoever it was in the comments. Ah, oh, I closed it. Um, but you suggested golden apples for some of these decks, and well, that's why. N not only that, <laughs> the freaking dark world is uh, boosting it. I know. Because <laughs> the tokens are freaking. This is so good with this setup. <laughs> oh man. All right. Um, let's see what we can do here. I'm gonna set a card. Uh, huh. Well, I guess I want to attack things. Let's see what I can do with uh, Phantom of Chaos, though. Let's see. Can I just turn him into, like, Grapha? Is that how he works? Let's see. Any battle damage with your opponent from battles and pop Ah, fair. I, I mean, I'll take that to get rid of a Solemn, honestly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, I don't have any special effects I can do with my Dark World dealing, so I'll hold off on it for now. But unfortunately, uh, actually no, I do have a special thing. Yeah, I have one thing. Let's see. That could be fun. Let's try it. I'm, this deck might actually be accidentally so good. So I'll send that guy to the graveyard, and when I do that... I get to summon him, and... Aw, oh, that doesn't do it. Let's see, if this card was discarded from your hand to the graveyard by an opponent's card effect. Okay, that's the case. Never mind, didn't do exactly what I was hoping. But, I can swap him out for one of these dudes. Okay. Sure. And uh, let's fight. I want to just attack Obelisk, right? Ah! 
Really good. That is really good that you had that. Okay. <laughs> Let's go ahead and attack that guy then. Gets you some more Marsh Macarons. Probably no point in attacking him in that situation, but so be it. So be it. Hmm. Yeah, it's a shame, man. That is a darn shame. You might... Ooh, I was feeling good about this duel, but now you're, you have full advantage against me. Hmm. Yeah. And it's hard to kill Obelisk because he's one—he's actually the only god card that comes with the... You cannot target him with card effects. Yeah, too. that's really nice. Well, that's all I can do, essentially, this turn. So, let... Actually, nah, that's not going to help me much. I kind of want to use that. Okay, I'm going to end my turn. Hope I can draw better next turn. That's good. Cause... Yeah, maybe I should be able to use this more often. Yeah, I keep um not using Gate to the Dark World because the first turn I tried it, it wouldn't let me. Light and Darkness Dragon. I'm sorry, what? Uh. Oh, darn. What's that do? Why? Uh, this card loses. When this card is destroyed and sets to the graveyard, target one monster in the graveyard. Destroy all cards you control. No, you don't want to do that, do you? It's not giving me an option to. Yes! <laughs> that sounds fun. Oh, I, mean, you got I got Macaron. Wall. Wow, Th that moment when you make a play you didn't know was going to be so good. Solemn, though. Yeah, <laughs> for sure, man. All right, Um. Oh. well, let's see if I can do anything with Gates of the Dark World. Uh, let's see. So I, essentially what I do with this is I banish a fiend. Um, then I get to discard a fiend monster and draw a card. So this is really good because I'm just going to banish this guy because he's not going to do anything for me. I am going to discard my beige, which lets me draw a card. And when he's discarded, free summon. So that's cool. I could bring out my other Greffa right now, but instead, yeah, I think it's time for this guy. So we can oh, get... but you're not going to be able to initiate a battle phase this turn, though. Nah. It's all good, though, because of that. Uh, what's my effect on this guy? I get to summon a token for each... Let's see. Each time your opponent normal summons a monster. Which you can... I... Then you, you contribute that token to raise his attack to 5,000. Oh, I contribute a monster and the card gains attack equal to the attack of the tribute monster until the end phase. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. That would be cool to get <laughs> to tribute my Grafa's attack for that. But, but it's, it's only until the end phase. Yeah, so it's not going to help me right now. And we've been holding on to the Fallen Paradise. And we're going to be real cheeky right here. Oh, this is a good turn for me. I am going to activate a card called Dragged Down Into the Grave. Now that we both have one card, so you have to uh, <laughs> discard your final ob... Actually, you might be running three. And I get to do an effect since that card is discarded. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> Might as well activate. Uh, oh yeah, I have a dark summoning beast in the grave. I mean, sure. Why not get my other one in my hand? It's just a dark world. It's just a good engine. Yeah, it's a really good, and it really adds to this. I'm so happy about this. Um, and I can get the Grafa out here and replace it that guy. And yeah. Let's see if I have anything crazy. Oh, but let's just add insult to injury. Um, I think just for safety purposes, we're going to get Hope Harbinger out here. Because that's in this deck. Oh. Because it's got easy to summon level 8, you know? Let's draw yeah. two cards, shall we? <laughs> okay. I think I'm in just... good shape now. Okay. What were you saying? Sorry, I cut you off a little. Uh, nothing. Just gonna hold out for me now. <laughs> I mean, you can with the Marsh Macaroons, essentially. Uh, okay, I have another drag down into the grave and a card I would like you to discard, but you get to choose my card that I discard, right? Yeah. Yeah, so with Raviel in my hand, it's no big deal, really. So, uh, What I'm going to do is I will set this card, because otherwise I'm never going to really use it from what it looks like. Ooh, and I have myself a Pot of Duality, because why not? Uh, let's see. I could switch that out for a Grapha. This can let me get a level 3 something out here. So that could be cool. Ah, uh, Phantom of Cash just sounds fun, though. It sounds really fun. 
Uh, but I want to try stuff while I'm here, so we'll try that out. And I already summoned, which I probably shouldn't have, but it's fine. Actually, no, it requires a special summon, so regardless, I did the right play. Let's attack things. Rawr. It's not going to do anything. Uh, oh, wait. Yeah, it is. Solemn. <laughs> On a marsh macaroon. Kind of worth it, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, you are in such a hole right now. I got Harbinger up here to stop you from spell or trapping me. I got <laughs> Fallen Paradise to stop your effects from getting Raviel. Oh, you are in a bad place. I pro if I didn't try bringing out the Light and Darkness, I probably would still have Obelisk on the field, to be completely honest. Yeah. Well, I guess we might as well try this. Uh, uh Yeah, we're just going to attack first. Da -da -da. Hit that. Oh, yeah, and you're out. Uh-oh, what's he do? Nice. Not that it's going to matter. Well. Yeah. I took it down with me. <laughs> yeah. All right. Rematch. All right. I accidentally stumbled into a great deck, didn't I? Possibly. Just all the search power and draw power I got running here. Ooh, this is actually doesn't look like a strong first hand, though. Well, I got Neil Space and Grand Mole. Battles an opponent's monster, you can opponent it to the hand. Sure. You can opponent it to the hand. English. Uh, okay, <laughs> no, now I do have a card now. Uh, so... Yeah, let's just go ahead and uh, Dark World Dealings. See if I can get a free card here. Because I got a Dark World card to discard. Um, ooh, should I get the free summon? Uh, it's really no point because you just returned me to my own hand. So, let's do this one. Because he's tougher. Ba -ba -da -ba. What you got? Ba -ba -da -ba. Sure. It's all good. I uh, didn't really get anything too crazy there. I guess I might as well normal summon. And not attack. Because, I mean, if I did, I would just go back to my own hand. And then you can summon again and attack me! So now, I'll at least force you to attack me if you want to send me back to my hand. Which you probably won't, so. Because you don't really get anything out of it. Well, I kind of do. I slow you down. You slow yourself down too, though. Not really. Okay. Let's see. Oh, baby. Terraforming, and since I don't have any sign of getting my... Oh, I actually do. Potentially. Nah, I think I'm going to start with the... I think I did the right thing last time just by getting Gates of the Dark World first, getting myself established first before I bring out the God cards by using this. All right. Smart. It would have been the other card otherwise, so you're doing good. You're doing good. Uh, I think what we're going to do here is uh, go into uh, just this guy again. And now I can attack. Um, ew. And let's just see what it is. I'm sure it's nothing good for me. It might be a Marsh Macaroon at best. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Question is, are we about to repeat the th th thing from last game, Mario? What card do you have down there? Ha! Get out of here, you stupid Marsh Macarons! Wait, I can't activate Macarons again? No, once per turn. Oh. Oh, people abuse that in competitive, saying that you can activate each one once. <laughs> oh, no. What you gotta do is you gotta, like, bait it a little bit to make the best of it, so your opponent essentially needs three or four attacks to stop it once and for all. If you're if you bait it properly, mm. so yeah, it's pretty nice. Um, huh. I guess we're gonna do the thing. I can bring out Raviel right now. Yeah, might as well. Dark summoning beast. Let's do it. Well, at least you won't be tugging my face down this turn. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I'll end my turn there. That should be good. Haha! -ha! Token time! I don't know how to use these tokens. I guess I'll just defense mode it? Yeah, they're just literally there just to feed his 1,000 attack points. That's really completely worth it for you to strike me here, though. 
Yep. Yeah, so good. You don't even lose points. That's really good against a god card deck. Yeah, that's why I was thinking, what can screw him over? Ah, I didn't think of you. I didn't think of the duel like that. <laughs> I just tried to make a good deck, and clearly, might be working. Okay. So what do we got here? What we threw a Graffa in there. I don't have any cards that can work with that per se, but I do have a Phantom of Chaos. So we can uh, here comes with that. So here um, comes another one. Yep, so I just got to ban... Uh, I don't want to banish my Graffa, though. Oh, yeah, I can Dark Summoning Beast. That's right. Why would I, though? That's so I don't have to banish Graffa, essentially. Yeah, pretty much. That's what we're doing. It's not going to really help me much, but... Let's just do it. That does ca carry on with the effect, though, so... Yep. You can activate your battle phase. Oh, yeah? Wait, Watch you... this. No, it doesn't do anything, I don't think. Um, yeah, I can't attack. All right. Well, I get more tokens out of the deal, so. If you do the same move again, that is. More tokens! But also, uh, yeah. Let's get this one in attack mode to look fierce. They're Grand mode. Attack Raviel once more. Nice. Nope. Solemn. Worth. <sighs> so worth. Hmm. Haha. -ha. I have gotten you this time. At least he solemn just a grand mole out of everything. Yeah. I mean, that's not the worst thing to lose to a solemn. We we both know that. Yep. Um, well, to be fair, you can't even solemn a. Uh, you can't even solemn a. Uh, Obelisk. True, yeah. So, And I guess that's kind of the main power of the deck, because with the Egyptian gods, you kind of got to focus down on them. Um, let's yeah. see. So, discard it to your graveyard by effect. I would love to do that. Oh, wait, no, that's to my hand. Oh, well. At least I have a Graffa. Well, let's start doing some things. Now, I'm going to start with a Graffa. Because who knows what that could be? It's probably nothing good. Oh, nasty. Huh. Let's see. Well. How to defeat that. Do I have ways to defeat that? I think I do. From what I've like, been reading. You did already use too. your Raigeki though, so. Yeah, the Raigeki definitely ain't gonna cut it. I burned a Solemn, so that's not gonna work. Let's see. No obvious ways. Let's see. That's not really going to help me a ton. But what I can do is... Hmm. I guess what we're going to do is normal summon this one. Uh, yeah. That's probably what we want. And... Oh, jeez. That's not good. <laughs> I, I, I hate how Wango probably delays it when it's like, ah, you want to activate something? You want to activate something? Just so you can never really know. <laughs> yep. Um, and honestly, we're going to pop this on a token. Actually, no. Let's see. Um, dear, 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 dear. Let's see. Once per turn, you can tribute a monster. So let's see if this works. Oh, it doesn't activate the effect of it. Oh, well. Oh, it has to be from the hand. <laughs> oh, from the hand for that one. Okay. Yeah, because sure. discarded discarded only works from hand. Yes. Right. The the language of Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, okay. So, I guess what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fight the face down. Rawr. Let's do it with the big guy. Just so we can, like, get hurt worse. <laughs> you monster. <laughs> you mean, mean man. <laughs> Fine. All right. Oh man, this is rough, man. This is rough. Uh, if yeah, I knew all of these cards. If only I knew how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, this won't hurt. I mean, it's not gonna help a ton, but ah, uh, do I want? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, I should have put some level ten Xes into here or something. 
That's honestly, good. I thought you would have. Honestly, yeah, I didn't even think about it. I didn't touch. I didn't touch the Xyz at all in this deck. I just went with whatever was in the Dark World mumbo jumbo. Um, okay, so that's not bad. I could bring out another Raviel right now, but I don't see how that's gonna help me. I think I know what I want to do. Um, this wouldn't be a bad idea. Hmm. Huh. But I also need to get through these stupid monsters, man. <laughs> I could silent honor one of them. Oh, you can't. Oh, you can't. They weren't. They weren't special summoned. Oh yeah, true. You're right. You're right. Um, could I castell them, or is that the same thing? Uh, no, that's no you could. Face you down, which won't help me. <laughs> or you could return them to the hand. I think it's not gonna help me for long, though, is it? Nope. Ah, uh, what options do I have? I'm scrounging through this. Uh, let's see. Does Tachyon Dragon do something good? Let's see. All other face-up monsters on the field have effects negated. Yeah, that sounds good to me. That's what we're aiming for. Okay. Not gonna read the rest of the card. We're just gonna hope it works. No, you don't. You won't. You wouldn't. Okay. Oh yeah, you'll just do it now. <laughs> hmm. Well, either way, whenever. Let's go for it. Hit me with it. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Ha! Life point damage. And yeah, that'll end my turn. Darn it. Oh man, I don't have any like support for these guys. I'm getting the monsters out, but I'm not getting the support. Aha! Free token! Oh, no free token! Jeez. No defense for him. None of my field cards. Well, what comes next? I'm going oh, to... Know. Special summon this by discarding light and dark. Oh, okay. Hard so, I could, so that I could tribute these cards for Obelisk, Ooh. the Tormentor. Very nice. Salem. Oh, wait, I can't. Then. No! Spirit. Not the attack mode Spirit Reaper, not him! Actually, Anything he, but he, him. he does have a useful effect while attacking. Oh, what is it? I can randomly discard a card from your <laughs> Oh, that's not fun. Okay, good. It's a battle fader. Golden apples. Hi there! Back again. He's just tied with you, though. Do we go for the battle damage against the Spirit Reaper? Let's see. You need to tribute two monsters for Obelisk's effect to kick in. Okay. I guess we'll, uh, if Oblish is gonna be on the field, I mean, I don't know what to do here. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna hold on to a card. And token! It's threat. Worth. So worth for you. Okay. Well. <laughs> battle phase! No. Um, <laughs> okay. Can you charge up Oblish, though? Oh, but you can get another monster out and just wreck That's me. That's heart of the card. That's the heart of the card right now. I need a monster. <laughs> And it's probably a pretty good chance because you got a ton of effect monsters. Oh, you didn't get one! You didn't get one! It's not bad though. Hold on. Wait. Let's see. Derp -a -derp -a -der. Cannot be targeted or destroyed by card effects. Wait, mm. what the hell? What? It's allowing me to activate Obelisk, but it's like, is he gonna tribute himself? Yeah, he would. He totally would. I've done it before. Don't do it. I mean, oh, unless no. you would like to do it, that is, I guess. I don't think it's worth it for you to do it, per se. But, yeah. let's see. Hmm. Kind of want to just hold on to these. Um, but I guess I just want to attack. I mean, can't do anything to Spirit Reaper, but... Like, I'm trading a token for an Obelisk. So, let's do it. Yeah, like that's gonna be worth doing. And I'll just summon an attack position monster. Oh, I could have brought out Greffa there. Oh well, no big deal. Dang it! Woo! Monster. I br I j no, I drew the perfect card actually. That would have been the biggest f you. Oh no! All right, uh, let's go ahead. Bring that out. And summon again! And bring this out. 
Now, unfortunately, you got rid of my guy who can get through the Spirit Reaper, so I'm still in trouble here. <laughs> Um, but at least I got a tough field. Uh, should I go into Harbinger? I kind of want to. Yeah, I think that's safer than just having these guys out here. Let's see. If this card is discarded to the graveyard by card effect, um, I need to figure out how this works. The other way, I can't use it right now. So, because I don't got nothing to discard it with. So let's just do that. That sounds like a safe play. I mean, yeah, if I get a... If I do get a spell card that helps me out right now, you could just negate it. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, that's the good card for right now. Um, is it actually? What's in my graveyard? Oh yeah, I got a Raviel in there. Let's Phantom of Chaos that, shall we? Now, I want to see if we can get a little Fallen Paradise action with it. No, I wouldn't like to get rid of my own spell card. That would be bad. <laughs> All right. Ooh, or I could Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon. Oh, that's so much smarter. You need an overlay unit. Oh, yeah, I do. Let's see. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. I can make a second attack. I can detach and then all face up monsters. I have an effects negated. If I could transfer them from my Harbinger, which could get like unlimited overlay. That would be <sighs> broken if you could, though. I know. <laughs> well. I guess. Well, I can at least fall in paradise. Cause that works. Yeah, I've done that before. I do remember when we did a uh, sacred beast versus sacred beast. I've done that to draw. Mhm. Mm I think I used that in the armor tile deck. That's all I got. Okay. Okay. Part of duality. Nope. Mine. <laughs> Try your spell cards. I love um, Hope Harbinger. He's so trolly. Alright, let's bring out this dude. And now... Um, ooh, what can I bring from here? Oh yeah, I can bring in a level 4. Uh, let's see. Would Utopia help me? Nope. I mean, you're not this really isn't activating a response or anything. Yeah. I could change it to face down defense position. Which doesn't really help me. Let's see. Okay, Diamond Direwolf. Once per turn, I can target a Beast, Beast Warrior, or Wing Beast on the field and destroy him. <laughs> it's not very useful here. Let's see. Cards activated and the effect can't be activated with Abyss Dweller. Yeah, there's just not a lot of, not a lot, not there's not a lot of stuff on here that I can work with. All right, let's try activating Phantom Chaos. What can I do? Huh. And I ain't got nothing. Tachyon Dragon. Oh, wait. Hold on. I can obviously go. Can I go from Tachyon Dragon into... Yeah. Oh, wait. No, that's not what I want to do. Oh, well, no big deal. It's not like it's going to hurt me. Yeah, you want to take the attack saw, points of Spirit Reaper? <laughs> I saw a big scary dragon. Wait. No, never mind. That's not what I wanted. Uh, So, it's... You know, it is what it is. I, it's not a solution or a hindrance right now. Yeah, Spear Reaper just keeping me alive. Mm -hmm. I had like three counters that you've stopped so far. So. Yeah. Ooh, I gotta try not to deck myself out this duel. Because I can easily do it. I can easily do it. Um. Yeah. I just love how it's the basic cannot be destroyed by battle that's keeping you at bay too. Yeah, because that's the thing. This isn't a rounded deck. I didn't like consider that i mean i actually do to be fair it has like several counters that can be worked with um let's see i could have summoned another monster but i don't care yeah let's just go for the brow doesn't matter what dark world monster it is because we're just gonna activate from where's my graph did i discard my graph for some reason did I just... oh he's still under uh, this can i activate an effect with this no i don't know what his effect does let's see um, if a face of Exe monster you control is destroyed by battle, you can target something and it gains attack and blah, 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 blah. Nope. Let's attack. Let's attack and see if we can at least wreck ourselves. You've wrecked yourself. <laughs> have I, though? Yes, I have. Okay. Um, so, that being done, I will... Yeah, that's not good, actually. That's not good. Alright, end my turn.
Yeah, I should have just kept using a... Oh, wait, no, I have to discard the thing, so I get that. Yeah. And let's activate a Jar of Avarice. Ooh, so yeah, you're at the advantage if this comes to the deck out. Darn it! I know three things that are coming back. Those are the three things. <laughs> oh, man. It's definitely a two-duel a two duel episode with how much you've stolen. Ooh, that soul exchange is looking promising, ain't it? Yep. Ah, but you gotta get that obelisk. It's fair. Well, he's the whole point of this deck, so... Yeah, he's your... I mean, you can deck me out if you want to, but that's the way you're gonna offensively beat me. Ah, please have something else in this deck. Man. I may take some damage, but this may be worth it just getting rid of a card in your hand. Actually, well, maybe not, because I'm running Dark Worlds. So cons- No! The <laughs> one card that it couldn't have been! The one card! All the other cards would have been great! That's it. Fine. That's it. Pick another card for me to discard. You know, I'll pick one for here. Want to play like that? Fine, we'll play dirty. <laughs> Discard whatever you want. Um, I don't know what like They're what is the dead. least. Um, let's see. Uh, probably the beige guy. Then he, ju I just summon him. Uh, let's see. You probably don't want to do snow, and the other guy's just stronger, so probably not. Yeah. Uh, and you don't get the special minutes. summon though. Yeah, it's draw power. I don't need to. Let's see. I mean, if I mean, you deck yourself out, though. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I'm. I don't care about decking myself out. I want to hopefully get something that can still slow you down here. So let's. I can do some life point damage. Yeah. Uh, so let's go ahead and. Why can't I special summon? I mean, you said that, but why wouldn't I be able to? Oh, your bro. Your you, he. All of them had a special summon themselves when discarded, but. Oh, Bro okay. didn't. That guy doesn't do it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yep, and I got him back now, and a stronger monster. Yeah, which was gonna probably yeah. happen with whoever. But I, I did dis I did discard your Ravio. <laughs> no, that was good. Having him in attack mode completely worth. Then again, it's not like Ravio was helping me much against Despair Reaper. Um, but that's all I can do. Yeah, but is that both of them at this point? Yeah, that's both. I only run two. Just run in three, then you got a chance of just like slowing yourself down. And two should be enough. But you know, in 31 turn duels, not necessarily. Alright, what can you do though? I think that's both your obelisks too. No. Oh wait, no, you sent one back. You sent one back and just drew it, yeah. Yeah. Um... That was a good choice to have. I think that's the yeah. only thing way you can offensively beat me, which obviously is how we want to do this duel. We don't want to show you guys a video where we deck each other out all the time. So. Yeah, I think this may be a one v one deal. Like if you can, like if you can finish it off, it'd be two zero. But then, this this duel is already longer than it, than it we expected oh, yeah, it to be. Absolutely. Huh. There's a way. There's a way I can make things happen, Mario. Um, well, I could bring out another Graffa, not that that's gonna help me, honestly. Um, yeah, because Tachyon's out of play. Yeah, and that's the only thing that could have done something. Um, I could bring Hope Harbinger back out. Would that be worth it, though? It's not a bad thing, then I can at least stop any advancements you might go for. But honestly, it's not important to me right now. I have different plans. Not good plans, but different plans. I'll end my turn there. <sighs> Gotta end right there. Ah, uh, this is gonna be really hard for me to pull off. Alright, we are going to normal summon this. And I think... Let's see. Is it worth bringing something out just because? I mean, I could bring out Utopia. I could bring out Castell. It's not really gonna help me. <laughs> I guess that is the one weakness of uh, Dark World is that they don't have any potential like targeted card on the field to destroy it or anything. I had a couple things. Yeah, it doesn't have a lot. It doesn't have a lot. The other car the cards I had that could do it were just like, you know, whatever. And you already wasted your one Raigeki as well. Yeah, the Raigeki, the Tachyon. 
and one other thing which I forget. Yeah, might as well activate this then. Discarding this. Okay. Yeah. Smart. Got a solemn out of play, and another. Was that my apple? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was another apple. <laughs> yeah, that would have stopped obelisk. Is that both of your solemns at this point? I think it is, because I think I'm only running that... two. Yeah, no, that was uh, your solemn was a long time ago, so. Yeah. Oh yeah, you used that on the macaron. Now I remember. Which I'm not gonna say was a bad idea. I fully stand by that, even to this point. Because I can't activate it on Spirit Reaper, so. Darn it. Hmm. You know, I would have been. I would have expect. You know what? I was coming into Zul expecting one thing. Yeah. And what? A fairy box. <laughs> I was totally expecting that to be honest. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I do have. Oh wait, no, I was about to have a fairy box in here, but I don't. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna sacrifice this guy to bring out this one, cause we are. And after that, end my turn and hope and pray. The audience might not know what I'm doing right now, but trust me, I might. There's a small chance I know what I'm doing. A very small chance. <laughs> The smallest of chances, man. Yep. Turn it! Stop drawing more stuff! Ah! <laughs> I don't want these cards! I just love the fact that you burned all your destruction card effects so early and now it's just coming back right now. You, you have a lot of cards that can't be destroyed by battle, though. At least two of them that I've seen. Plus the magical runes, yeah. which, unless I have a field that's as threatening as the one I have right now, can't be destroyed by battle, so... Yeah. Stand by that decision. Just, on, Just being a bit annoyed by you. <laughs> okay. No, that's not going to help me much. I think win or lose, I think this is going to be the end. <laughs> oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, we're going to do that. And end my turn. Oh, thank you. Nice. Oop. What can you get? Ooh, shrink. Ah, sure. Why not? <sighs> I love how I'm just ignoring everything else you're doing. I'm just like, all I need to do is do a thing. Okay. We might be okay here. Let's see. Nope, I don't want to use that on this card. Anything else? You know what I can do? Let's see. Nope, don't want to do that either. What can this do? Yeah, let's try this out. Um, it's not, it's not going to help me too much. Let's just get this over with. Uh, no, let's, let's not play that card right now. Let's not. Let's just do the thing while we can. All right, so here's the plan. I'm going to summon this monster, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's very important. So I'm going to activate Fallen Paradise. Okay. Just to get that out of my hand. Now I'm going to set this card... And I'm going to activate Drag Down to the Grave. And I don't care what I get rid of here. Let's just get rid of that Lightness and Darkness Dragon. Because when I discard this card, which, you know, honestly, in hindsight, I might need to have free spaces on my field, which I have no way of controlling anyway. He can destroy one card on the field! Can I do it? I did it! Mario, I did it! <laughs> I got past problem number one! Uh, okay. What about three? How about one through three in the back row? We're, we're gonna find out if it's possible, Mario, okay? You shouldn't have done that. I mean, I don't care. Mario, I got past the big problem. <laughs> I am not opposed to. Like, I had to summon him to do anything, so. I'll be completely honest. If you would have just straight out attacked, you would have won. The chances were very low of that, though. I stand by the decision. All right. All right. We are going to go ahead and... You know, I don't know if I have the cards to make that work, so we're just going to go like this. I really hope this doesn't go to a deck out. <laughs> don't worry. As long as I can get some stuff, we're fine. Uh, I'm not going to lure of darkness just because you have a point. <laughs> so with that, I'm going to end my turn. Hmm. 
Okay, and I know you got that obelisk. So. Oh wait, no, you don't. I got rid of him a while ago. Nope, not gonna activate Curry Bandit. That's a bad idea. <laughs> Look how juicy my graveyard is. Yeah, that's high. All right. You know, we could have possibly also tossed in a exchange of souls. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll do that. That'll protect me against spell and traps. But you can easily just have more monsters that'll slow me down. Ah, the one thing that can get through it. Yeah, that's a shame. Yeah, I don't know and if that's... I can uh, do anything then. Yeah, my stalling tactics have worked so far. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. All right, set this down, and I'm just hoping I draw into him. Yep. Who are you trying to draw into? I still have one in the deck. Oh, you do? Okay, I didn't know you had three. No, no, no. I only have two, but I put one back, remember? Yeah, but I thought I got rid of that one, too. Nope. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. Yeah, go ahead, draw into him. I don't care. <laughs> I'm past that at this point. Um... <laughs> Yeah, we're just going to go ahead and attack. See what happens. Because that's all I can do right now. You wanted to defend that one last time. Ah, yeah. I just wanted to get rid of the whole Harbinger, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, no. That's a great choice. Since you banish him, that'll work out real nice. In, in hindsight, I should have been a little more patient, but, you know, what am I going to do? E... Yeah. Okay, so this should cut down the time. Oh, yeah, beautiful. As long as that other card can't be destroyed. And you can probably just summon something else, too, to be honest. Yep. I guess just set this down for now, and then ending. Cool. Uh, let's see. Hey, I got another Dark World Dealings. Let's see. Okay, do I have any level 3s that can get through those guys? <laughs> Let's see, detach stuff, send as many cards from the top of my deck to the graveyard. Nope! <laughs> Not even going to finish that effect. Let's see. <laughs> let's see if this face-up card would be destroyed. Let's see, once per turn. This you are on finished. a t hard time limit right now. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. This card might be something. Uh, what about this card? I can gain attack. Great. Nope. Let's see, detach a material, target one monster, I control one my opponent controls and destroy them. Yeah. Now that I got, like, my level three card, there's, like, some stuff that can actually be done. Um, so let's summon this. Go ahead and use its effect. What you doing to me, Mario? Just looking at options. Just oh looking boy. at options. Get Curry Bandit <laughs> out here. And I'm just gonna get rid of him, because I don't want him to use his effect. Um, so, I guess we want to get out this guy? Yeah, it's not great, but it's... Yeah, I don't see myself winning this duel, I'm not gonna lie. Um, hmm. Yeah. Certainly doesn't help. I gotta do this, I really do. Alright, I'm gonna do this. So that, yeah, if you bring your one guy back, it's not going to help you at all. Um, ooh, but no, you got Obelisk coming out soon. Darn it. Let's see what the behind door number two. Probably nothing great, but, yeah, it's not going to help you any. Hmm. Oh, that's going to help you a lot. <laughs> yep, that's that. And... At one point, Spirit Reaper was limited to pu to just one, and then back then. Yeah, I can see that. I have some potential ideas, but like, once Obelisk comes out, I definitely don't want to use any of these cards I have. <laughs> um. Yeah. Wait, let's see. Let's see if this card is discarded to graveyard. Okay, discard it so I can use this safe enough. Let's go ahead and get another one of these guys out. All my rank eights have been obliterated. Have I really burned through every single level? I, mean, I, I only had two, but. <laughs> Alright, let's kill a marsh macaron, because that's fun. 
Yes! Use the effect. Cool. Nah, I don't have three attacks anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, what's this thing? There you go. I'll end my turn. Uh, I don't know if I can pull anything off here. I would like to. But I don't know how. That helps. Cool. I know exactly what card you're tributing. Yep. <laughs> Definitely keeping one of those marsh macaroons. <sighs> Fortunately, I can't attack, so... Yep. You got one turn, Zylo. One. You got plenty of life points, man. No, before I start attacking. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Let's see. I will do the ancient technique of going to defense mode. And, yeah, with that, instead of playing one of the uh, five draw power cards I have, I think I'm going to end my turn. Is there any way for me to get one card from my graveyard to my hand? What are you hoping to grab? One card. You have four. I have three. I need one card to turn this around. <laughs> hmm. I don't know. All because I put one recycling card in this deck. If I had played one less... Yeah, the, the recycling card saved you. If I had put one less draw power card, I would win this duel. Hey, <laughs> Spirit Reaper. Oh no! Smart. Oh, yeah, you can't do that. Okay. Yeah, I just wanted to activate it for once. I never get. I've. That's actually the first time in my entire dueling career that yeah, I've actually enough. got to activate. Mario, I have <laughs> six draw power cards. <laughs> <laughs> I have so much draw power in this deck, but it's not going to work against the stall deck, is it? Oh, and I'm gonna summon him out just for the extra damage. Yep. Come at me, bro. Ow! It hurts. It hurts so bad. Obelisk attack. Alright. I did my math right. Golden apples. Okay. No, I drew! No! You monster! <laughs> It's over. <laughs> that that was the part that changed this. I was going to manipulate it, get to the edge of your turn, Dark World Dealings, so we both had no cards, but it was my turn. I probably should have let you, because you forget one card I have face down. What? Shrink. Target one face on monster in the field, the original attack of that monster is halved. No, I'm saying I would have decked you out. If I could have survived another turn. <laughs> well, rawr. I can still do it, assuming none of your back row is of any use. I'm sure that's a possibility. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> well, that's that, isn't it? That's that. <laughs> Let's discard snow. And a lord darkness, and when I discard, oh, when I discard like that, I don't get the effect. <laughs> Not that it would matter. Well, at Obelisk. least you can finish me by attack points. You won't deck me out. <sighs> Fifty-nine turns. Do you want to go around? <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you want Mario to change that deck, let us know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, legitimately, that's how you gotta work with some of the Egyptian god cards. I mean, in retrospect, it did work. <laughs> I mean, did it? Oh, yeah, I guess it did. Check me out. So, leave a like on the video if you just want to see us use some other cards. Um, Really, any other cards would be great. And we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>